Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of our Skyrim Let's Play. Uh, in the last episode we done a little hunt for this bow. Uh, it's called Ruin's Edge and it is a bit of homage to some Oblivion DLC. You may or may not know it. <laughs> the Shivering Isles. Um, the bow itself looks very fundamentally different to how it did in that game. If I'm not mistaken. I'm sure Ruin's Edge in that game was just sort of black with white dots on. Um... You know at the joints it had sort of white balls at the joints but yeah um we have this now it's an enchanted bow it applies a random effect upon hit it's also hitting harder than the other bows that we had access to at this level so it's a really nice one to have and it was free it just took a little bit of fucking know-how a little bit of uh combat prowess a bit of trial and error <laughs> and uh and we got it so, now we're heading south to Riften. I, I think. I'm just sort of following the path. Um, once we get to Riften, we will probably join the Thieves Guild. This is going to be an all-inclusive character, you know? We're going to do everything. We're going to be a companion. We're going to be a Master Thief. Nightingale. The lot. Deidre Worshipper. You know, everything. Which reminds me actually worship, something that we haven't really lent too much into. I know I've, I've tried a couple of shrines. I don't think we've gotten one that really agrees with our playstyle yet. There it is, we're running, we're running. Um, but yeah, we, we're still on the lookout for a bit of potential. Can we shoot this from horseback? What do you think? Got it. And it applied frost to a frostbite spider. <laughs> Through the tree. Got it. We're good. I'm not great at uh, mounted combat on this game, but that'll do. For one enemy, it's worth a try. So yeah, this might be a little bit of a shorter episode. Um, there are some things that I've got to shoot off and, and get done. Might go for about half an hour, maybe 40 minutes. Um, but it will definitely be more on that side than an hour. You know? Um, I think we'll stop here real quick. Just so we have the quest to go in and clear out the, uh, clear out the mine. Here what's wrong with the mine? Yeah, it's full of spiders. That's what's wrong with them. Okay, cool. Blah, 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 blah. Town guard won't help. No, 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 no. I'll clear them out. Tell you what. Keep to Great. Great. Ooh. Chicken eggs. There it is. Now, there is a fort between us and Riften. And I don't much like the idea of going to uh, battle the residents. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Janassa, help, please. Janassa, please. I'll just do it myself. Fucking useless. Can I get through unscathed? I'm unsure. But I'll give it a go. Over the top. Whee! Just leg it. Just leg it. Yep, I think we made it. There's a little tower up there which we've got to do a little stop for. 100%. Because there is an amulet which will give us better sell prices located up on that perch. Thank you. 
something hiding up there too. Anything? Wrong one. Ah, oh, the bear. There it is. I see it. I really need to get Atromancy. Reason them further away is going to be a massive health. Or the staff. One of the two. It needs to happen. Because it's just painfully close. Yes? Mr. Bear? I could probably just grab this while I'm here. Yep. Run, 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 run. Turns out I didn't need to kill him. Oh. Cool, let's go. Now, because I don't have the patch installed, I could go into each of these towers and read the evidence chests, which I'll probably do on the way out. Just to see if there's a greater soul gem. Unsure if there would be. Hold there. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. Well, what's the tax for? For the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Well, this is obviously a shakedown. Want everyone to hear you? I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. Cool. You do that. The gate's unlocked. Head inside when you're ready. There's a few dialogue sequences that we're going to have to get into. I don't know you. You and Riften looking for trouble? Just passing through? Yeah. Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see here. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. Who are the Black Briars? The Black Briars have Riften in their pocket and the Thieves Guild watching their back. So keep your nose out of their business. Me? I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Got any dirt on this? Only way you could have found one of those is by stealing it. Guess you'll fit in around here better than I thought. So what do you want to know? Tell me what it's worth. Do I look like a merchant to you? You're gonna have to take that up with Vex in the Thieves Guild. Get in good with them and you'll find her. Okay. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? Next time, keep your plans quieter, and nothing would have happened to it. What? Are you telling me you robbed it? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Look, Shadra, last warning. Pay up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. Try and practice the Debellin art. Come on, bring off. Guess how much money I've got. Well, make sure that Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. He wasn't hey, lass. I'm sorry. He what? I'm saying you've got the now coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. Very well. I can tell. I mean, I've done odd jobs for just about everyone in every city so far. I have cleared out bandit camps and I have sold my wares. It's about as honest as it gets. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lass. Wealth is my business. Hmm. Maybe you'd like a taste. 
What have you got in mind? I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra pair of hands. And in my line of work, extra hands are well paid. What do I have to do? Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're going to steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under his stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Looking to stay alive? Why plant the ring on Branche? There's someone that wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. So, how am I supposed to do all of this? Do you want me to hold your hand as well? I wouldn't mind. You have to sneak over to Medesi's stall and use your lockpick on the strongbox. Then, when you have the ring, you pickpocket Branche and leave it behind. I'm ready. Good. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Let's quick save this. Everyone, gather round. I have something amazing to show you that demands your attention. This way, everyone. Over here. You need to hear this. Okay, it's an apprentice lock. We have 12 picks. Might be a touch this side. Nope. Got it. Okay, so we get Medesis. Fucking gold as well. Okay, part one done. Quick save. No pushing, no shoving. Plenty of room. Gather round, all. Come on, Brynjolf. What is it this time? Patience, Branche. This is a rare opportunity. Come on, baby. The fairest prices and the hey, didn't even need to quit. If you wish to buy. What a Welcome waste to Rift time. Looks like I chose the right person for the job. And here you go. Your payment. Just as I promised. The way things have been going around here. It's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. 100 quid. Not bad. What's been going on? Nah. My organization's been having a run of bad luck. But I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. I can handle it. All right, then. Let's put that to the test. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Riften, a tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Get there in one piece, and we'll see if you've really got what it takes. You a stranger here too, huh? I've never seen me old this upset about anything. Please. Please, I need... Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. All right, Protect yourself, right. See if I've got anything I can sell him. Take a look. Let's have a look. Um... Nope. Nope. I'll keep those. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Fox, no, I won't. What brings you to the finest weapons and armor? I'll keep the gold all. I'll get rid of the oracalcum. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Is it yours? You're under arrest, Franche. This is insane. I didn't steal anything. I never saw this <laughs> before in my entire life. We can do this one of two ways. You can walk up with me to the keep. I can drag your Visitors like us are rare in this part. You're not from Riften. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Well, why are you here? Blah. Grimsever, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Grimsever, Grimsever, please. It's my great beast to be slain. And my fortune comes from gratitude and trust. Oh, it's a dark night. 
go get ourselves a bed. Are you going to address the public? Blessings of Mara upon you. I wanted to know more about the Temple of Mara. Wonderful. Where to begin? Mara is the goddess of love. The temple spreads her gifts by tending to the sick, the poor, and the lost. We also perform wedding ceremonies for all the loving couples in Skyrim. Oh, okay. I could have a wedding at the temple. Yes, if you were ready, of course. Are you familiar with how marriage works in Skyrim? Not really. Typically, love in Skyrim is as earnest as the people who live here. Life is hard and short, so there's little room for long courtship. A person who is looking for a spouse simply wears an amulet of Mara about the neck, showing they are available. When another person shows interest and the two agree to be together, one of them comes to the temple and we arrange a ceremony. No, I'm okay. Of course. I'd be more than happy to add a dip. Right now, the best you could provide is coin. Thank you. I can promise you that this will be put to good use. There's a donation for you and I'll get out my fiesse. Doc worker. Doc worker. Louis Latrush, you've got a name. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. What sort of message? Ah, well, I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest breeding horses in Skyrim. He agreed to sell. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. Sounds easy enough. Ah, you're a smart woman. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Head to the Riften Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Riften. You'll be well paid for your time. I'll meet you outside of town. Okay. I don't have any business with you, so get out of my face. If your allegiance lies with the Empire... If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. All right, meanie. What's the word around town? Mule the lioness used to adventure across Skyrim before she... Yeah, I've spoken to her. What else? Crime is an all-time high in this city thanks to the Thieves' Guild. Don't we have enough problems with the war going on? Yep, spoken to them too. What else? If it's true that the dragons have returned, what will it mean for all of us? Is this how it all ends? Oh, maybe. Come back and see. What do you oh, think? Oh, oh shit! I... Oh my! Oh my god! Oh my god! I stole a. Oh my! People really, really enjoy their sweet rolls. Ah. And take two. <laughs> I was speaking to him. Literally went up to him. Went to speak to him. And I stole a boiled cream treat by accident. Yeah, what do you want? Maven? Ever and if the meadery is profitable. Tell me about Maven Blackbriar. Lady Maven could buy or sell any she's always welcoming. I'd also warn you not to cross her. She employs quite a few I'm selling the best meat in town. Crime is an all time. The city guard has been tearing Riften apart. I'll take a room, sure please. Thing. It's here for a day. Come right. back and see us. That'll do. Not a... Louis. Looking Give us a quick version, mate. I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. What sort of message? Skip, I skip, 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 skip. I want you to talk to Sibby. Sounds easy enough. Head to the rip. You'll be Sounds like a motorbike. Your time. Okay. I'll meet you outside of town. There it is. Okay, we'll sleep here. Give it a good 12 hours.
Food. Janassa, please. Before I trade you for Mercurio. Because this guy. This guy's fun. But he also won't tank for me the way I need him to. Because of my play style, he's going to end up getting plenty of range as well. Which means it's going to be sort of 6 and 2 threes to the enemy who the, who the attack. Janassa, she's going to charge in. So, I really need a, a warrior on my side, given my play style. He looks like he means business. Ooh, let's go have a chat with the, uh, the clumsy lady who runs the arts and crafts department. On these reports of dragons. Did we have an yes. appointment? Huh, that unpleasant I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. <sighs> it Man, this really is bullshit. While I'm in town, I'll put my um, amulet of Xenathar on. Price is ten percent better, or eleven percent better, but I have to remember. Okay, let's quick save. Wood first, then summon. Spark you out, bang! You there we're gone. Yeah. We need that greater soul gem. I want you to speak to the city guard. Make sure there's a contingency Ex plan. Spells in and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Still. Okay, this is happening. One, two. We're gonna find them now. You know for a fact we are. Oh, I can sell you potions though, can I? Spells and incantations. No, I can't. Talent to cast them. I can sell you that though. I can sell you the necklace. Uh, I'll sell you all that butcher stuff. We need that. We can sell you that. Can sell you that. We need these soul gems. Okay. Now where did I put those Good. spiders? If Riften should fall, it's only right that its leader be spared. I want to reclaim some of that money, so I think I'll go sell some of the excess portions I have. Uh, down at the alchemy shop, maybe make some more. Depending on what sort of goods they have. I'm unsure, does Grelka act like a general merchant? Can I sell portions to you? You're gonna see for yourself. I can. You are a general merchant. What else do we have? That'll do. Resist frost. I'll get rid of that. Okay. Come back when you're ready to spend more. That was good shit. All meats guaranteed, clean and free from rock joints. What do we need to do? So we've got the rat weirs that we need to go through. We've got our amulet of Zenithar. We don't need to do any more alchemy. Not right now. I think really the smartest thing that we could possibly do before we go any further is make sure that we go get the Kunja, the Storm Atronach staff and the Kunja Flame Atronach staff. They're the two that I really want. Uh, if we could get a Kunja Frost Atronach staff, that would be fucking class as well. But we'll need another Greater Soul Gem for that. Um, so for... It's an oracalcum ingot, a broom, void salt, and a great soul gem, the Storm Atronach. Um, it is a corundum ingot, fire salt, broom, and a great soul gem for the for the fire. 
and for the frost. What is it? Can't remember. Let me Google this real quick. Moonstone ore or ingot. Uh, do I even have the salts? I have fire salts. I've got frost salts. And I have void salts. So I'd need a broom and another greater soul gem. The pond prawn. I'm going to be able to buy an empty or filled well, greater soul gem up the uh, trinkets back up at the college. That sort of thing. There's no broom. There's a greater soul gem. I'll leave it in case I can get an empty one. Aye. I'll steal a broom. <laughs> Yeah, we need a. Oh, let me put my laptop on charge. Four dies on me. Great. Okay, so we're gonna head back up to the College of Winterhold. We're gonna get one of each staff. Working at the Rifton Fishery. If I can get a hold of um, the broom. Or two. I know there's definitely one. There's at least one. Looking to stay alive. In the um, underneath the college. There's one there. I can take it. Oh, there we go. One. There's two. I can probably find one around campus grounds. Protect yourself right. Buy armor from um, Moonstone. Beautiful Come to see better. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Two hundred and forty. Oh, jeez. There we go. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Okay, so we've got. There's a corundum. No, there's a oracalcum ingot already there. So we don't need that one. So now I've got Corundum and I've got the Moonstone. We've got one broom. See if we can find another one. And then it's a case of buying another another greater soul gem while we're there. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? I'd like to go back to the College of Winterhold, please. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Sure thing. Have you ever met one of them cats? Kaji, I think they called themselves. I hear this. Stalrim is one of the few armors that I don't have a mod for. Oh, I can give the uh, the staff back to this douche. Can I help you? My job is to serve the Jarl, not waste time talking with travelers. There you are. I don't really. This should come in handy. Here, let me show you a few tricks I've learned about buttering up royal. Here's a little song I wrote. <laughs> it won't let me sprint. Why? Sometimes it does that. Right, first we're going to need to get past the ice wreath that's already down there. 
think there's a broom over here. Hey, is he right or is he right? So we've definitely got one. We've definitely got enough brooms. Please don't bother the archmage. Restoration spells and what you got for seal? For those with a talent to cast them. And Mirabel spells and incantations for those with a talent to cast them. They're all full. Why is everyone selling full soul gems like that? I'm disappointed in you, Colette. I expected more. And there's another broom. Finis? Yeah, Finis is normally in here, isn't he? Where are you guys? And obviously, Tolfdia is over at Sarthol now. So he's gone. Don't know what Feralda's doing up there. You know, they say knowledge is huh? its own. So, you wish to master the arcane arts? Again? Seriously? Mm hmm. Till next time. Finnis, you are my last hope. You ugly man. Where are you? I can sleep here, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm not just sleeping. A hey, right. We sort of we have enough magic to do what we need to do right now. And again, I think the the whole concept of this build might be to just be squishy. So I think we'll go stamina. Conjuration's almost level thirty. Almost. Uh, we will be spamming our illusion soon. To try and get the silence casting. Is it, is it this one? Quiet casting, yeah. Level 50. That's achievable. I just didn't want to do it straight out of the gate. Ah, oh, come on. Finish. Got to be finished your shift already, mate. There he is. Don't you go to sleep. There. So you wish to master the arcane arts? None. No one. Uh, until next time. Hey. Come on, Janassa. Janassa, just move. I'm not in the mood. Mirabel does a fine job. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Fine. It's me completely skint. Okay, we need to mooch and get ourselves some conjuration staffs. And then there will be one final staff to add to the collection later on, which we'll have to go in a cave for. But the Staff of Paralysis is going to come in real, real handy. Yeah, we want the Conjure. I want that up. It's not that way. Is it? This way? Please, Janassa, don't get in my way.
Go get him. Go get him. and get it. Get there we are. Perfect. Right, let's take this. Let's take that. Let's take these, might as well. And we're good to go. So, offering box. A broom. We'll go for. Storm Atronach first. Because it's an important one. Ingredients, we'll go for the void salt. And then the greater soul gem. Boom. Staff of Storm Atronach. And again, go for the broom. Greater soul gem. Go for the frost one now. As the ingredients and it's the frost salt. This is just for tanking. If we ever get stuck, you can block uh, block hallways and things. There it is. Now we have our trio of weapons. Booyah. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Alright guys, there's very little else to do underneath the College of Winterhold right now. Is there an enchanted dagger around here, I believe? I thought there was. Hey, there it is. Dagger Sparks. We'll take that. We'll disenchant that. And give us a little bit of experience. But other than that, we are all done and dusted. So, we're geared up a little bit better now. Um, of course we have the three staffs, we've got Ruin Z for our bow, um, we could probably do with a half decent dagger uh, for when the time arises. I think next on the um, next on the agenda might be to lean into stealth a little bit more, so we'll probably purchase um, something like Courage, the, um, the spell tome for Courage. We'll equip the Necromancer's Amulet and we'll just spam Janassa until we're a level 50. Um, and then we get Quiet Casting. We're probably going to have some excess points to put into various things as well. And um, yeah, I think that's probably the plan. And we'll lean into um, our sneak build a little bit more. We'll be able to conjure Atronachs from strategic positions, hopefully unseen. And we'll be able to do some more dungeon delving as a result. So yeah. I think that's probably the plan going forward. But thank you guys for tuning in. My name is Brian. This is Botched Up Games. And remember, if you can't beat them, botch them. Take care.